how do you wave the shark with the people on the platform? Mm, oh, that's good a question. good question. Very good question. Do you want to handle that one? Um, well, the, the it comes from the estimate, right? Right, it's yeah. a formula. Yeah, basically, um, scientists for years have been collecting information about um, the length of sharks as well as uh, the weight of the sharks. And you can use that uh, to basically create a formula. So if you catch a shark that, that has a certain length, you can use the formula to, to extrapolate the weight from it. So we don't actually weigh the shark while it's on the cradle. We use that formula to get that information. Where do you get your data? What is the biggest hope to find in the data in the Jax expedition? <laughs> well, um, as you guys may have seen online, we actually were able to retrieve Lydia's accelerometer. So this is it right here. Um, so this was actually on Lydia and uh, popped off, and uh, Dr. Nick Whitney was able to go and, and find it and has already downloaded this data and um, has started analyzing, you know, basically we see the movements that Lydia made after she was released. So, um, you know, we see that she was swimming long, she had a little bit of a recovery period after the capture, but that she's, uh, you know, was swimming healthy um, until this until this tag popped off, and then we hear from her today. No, I mean one of the things we talk about in relationship to that is the fact that they've always been here, right? We're just learning about it and solving the puzzle right now. So they've always been there all this time, and uh, nothing should change. You should feel more enlightened than afraid. Yeah. What do you learn from the blood? What do you learn from the blood samples? All right, good question. Um, I always like when someone asks about the blood. <laughs> she, knows, she knows a lot about blood. <laughs> That's why I'm here. <laughs> um, well, basically, uh, there's a lot that we're trying to learn from the blood. Um, my, my role in it, basically, is, is trying to understand the health of the shark when it comes up on the cradle, um, just to make sure that, that the capture event you know, isn't too stressful for the shark. Um, and we're seeing that, you know, that they are a little bit stressed, but nothing that they can't recover from. Um, so, you know, we're just trying to get a handle on that, as well as their basic uh, physiology. You know, without having up close and personal, um, you know, contact with these fish, we can't get blood. So, um, we're really starting to learn about just their general physiology as well. Awesome. Thank you. Bye.